Hello and welcome. My name is Tyrion Lannister. All right, folks, today I'm really excited to bring something to you that I've been working on for a little while now. And I have basically broken down the monthly card for us, and specifically these weekly add-ons that you have to the right of the monthly card. Now, as a quick disclaimer, uh, the monthly card itself has been updated. I may at some point do a later video on the changes that were made to the monthly card and uh, whether or not I now think that it is worth it for its 100 black diamonds, but there's a lot there to discuss, and I'm going to save it for another one. For now, we're just going to discuss these weekly add-ons. They're brand new, and I think it's a lot of fun to talk about them. So, in order to do this analysis, there was a lot of math. So what I've done for you guys is I've gone ahead and done it already. I'm going to slide this over. And I'm going to try to break through for you guys, break down for you guys exactly what all of this is that's going on and explain to you so you can understand it. All right, so first things first, let's start with the first one. This is the research speed up one. Now, basically what happens here is you would get uh, 25 of the three hour research speeds and you get that once every day for a week so times seven uh, for a total of 525 hours of research speed up it's equivalent of about 21.87 days if you do some math and basically what i did was i i went to the vip shop and i used specifically in here the 60 minutes or the three hour speed ups which is the best price you can get for speed ups i'm using the best possible that you can do and i calculated that it would be worth about 21,000 blue diamonds for this all right so keep in mind that number now if we look at what comparing this to say just a regular 10 black diamond research pack would be um, that you get I already did the math for you 56 and a half hours or 2.35 days you also get 1300 more blue diamonds so if you multiply that by five which would be the price of 50 black diamonds if you bought that five different times you get a total of 11.77 days 6,700 blue diamonds for a total of 18,000 equivalent blue diamonds. All right, so we got 18,000 versus 21,000. So clearly the research is better to do it this way. And just if you compared it to some other packs, like the Time Administrator pack, which also gives a lot of research speed ups, that's about a 12,000 total blue diamond equivalent for 50 black diamonds. So definitely, um, the research one is, is definitely best from this weekly speed up pack. Um, things to keep in mind, this is definitely a lot less flexibility, and it takes a little bit longer. It's going to take a full seven days to get, and uh, as, as opposed to these packs, which you would get immediately. Also, it's less flexibility. You know, just converting it to the blue diamond equivalent isn't the same as having pure blue diamonds to be able to use. So just bear those things in mind for sure. The last thing I'll say about this is that despite it being a seemingly good deal, um, I think very few people actually need research speedups. I would very much so encourage probably most that they do not need this. If you think you do, I would honestly recommend that you just, you know, wait a little bit and once you reach the point where you've gotten all the research unlocked that you want, you're probably going to find that your research speedups are just going to waste since that's what most strong counts have reached. All right, but moving along, let's look at the honor banner next. So coming over here, the honor banner, worth 50 black diamonds. Um, you get 20 of them each day, so for a total of 140. This, uh, based on the VIP shop, where you get 400 bl uh, blue diamonds for an honor banner, that's worth about 56,000 blue diamonds. Um, so right off the bat, you can tell that this honor banner is a way better deal in blue diamond equivalent than the research pack. Um, definitely, definitely, I would recommend if you're going to do one, do the honor banner. Now, if we compare this to some other black diamond purchases in the shop, um, keep in mind there are a ton of different ways you can purchase honor banners, but the best one I found was just the basic honor banner pack. For 50 black diamonds, you get 30 honor banners, you get about 45 hours of speed ups, five friendship chests, and a little over, uh, basically for totaling them all up it's about 20,000 total blue diamonds you would also get some blue diamonds with it that are raw 
um, pretty clearly better to do the honor banners this way. Uh, sure, you don't get the speed ups to the friendship chests, but um, on the whole, you're getting just so many more honor banners, and, and it's kind of hard to come by them uh, outside of doing the VIP shop. So this is a great way to get a ton of honor banners pretty quickly um, and, and for a pretty good price. So definitely one to keep in mind. You're not going to see anything beat that 56,000 blue diamond equivalent. Next, we have the Ancient Scripture. Now, the Ancient Scriptures are a really interesting one, because before I even get into it, I want to make this disclaimer. Ancient Scriptures are a race right now. There's a race to see who can get to Tier 5 troops first. This is a brand new research tree. You know, the strangely garbed research is really important if you want to get to Tier 5 troops. And for that reason, anything that gives you Ancient Scriptures, there are a lot of people that are just buying anyway. But for sake of argument, let's talk through what this one is and whether or not it's worth it. So you get nine of them each day, times seven, you get a total of 56 ancient scriptures. Now, based on the VIP shop, they're worth 1,000 each. That's 56,000 blue diamonds. So right there, you may be saying, oh, it's the same as the honor banner. But keep in mind, this is worth 100 black diamonds versus only 50 black diamonds for the honor banner. So it is, it is not quite as good of a deal as the honor banner. Now, if we compare this to something, I think the best thing to compare it to is the Amethyst Shop. Now, the Amethyst Shop, for 60 black diamonds, you get seven days' worth, where you get each of these three things. Now, as you can see, there are a lot of other things other than ancient scriptures that you get, but for each one of these ten amethysts you get, you can buy two ancient scriptures for a total of six each day. Um, so for six times uh, those seven days, you get 42 ancient scriptures. You're also getting a bunch of other stuff, though. Now, I'm not going to talk about all the other stuff because, to be frank, it does make it way, way better. I mean, a way better deal. I frankly think everyone should be getting this amethyst shop. It is just a really, really good bang for your buck. Only 60 black diamonds, and you're getting a lot out of it. But if we just focus on the ancient scriptures, if we pretend that the only thing you're getting are the you know, the uh, 56 ancient scriptures here, or the 42 ancient scriptures from the amethyst shop. That comparison leads you to this down here, where 10 black diamonds from the monthly card pass, which I'm calling this one, gives you 5.6 ancient scriptures, versus the amethyst shop would give you 10 black diamonds for 7 ancient scriptures. So the amethyst shop is better, even if you just look at the ancient scriptures. Now, again, just because of that does not mean you shouldn't be buying the ancient scriptures here. Maybe you really want to race for it. You want as many ancient scriptures as you can get. In that case, I say go for it. Go for broke. Get the ancient scriptures. Now, the last one we have is the EXP scroll weekly card. Now, this one is another 50 black diamond one, and you get four purple uh, EXP scrolls, and you get a times seven, so a total of 28. Now, the way I'm going to, you know, kind of trying to math it up with the EXP scrolls is by actually talking about how much experience this gives. For the purple one, it gives 500 experience. So, when we do 28 times 500, we get 14,000 experience, which would be the equivalent, by the way, of 14 of the gold experience scrolls. Now, I also just here listed a few things that might help be helpful to people. Um, the gold skills themselves, if you're trading them in, are worth 240 experience, purple is worth 120, and blue is worth 60. So in terms of trying to convert this into a blue diamond equivalent, I decided to treat the advanced token as being worth about 120. Since on the whole, you're probably going to be getting about a third gold skills, a third purple, a third blue. It's a little bit more um, than 120 would be the average value of those three. But um, because I do think you're getting a little bit less gold skills than the others, I decided to just make it easier and say that it's going to be a total of 120 per advanced token. Um, it's maybe a little more than that, but that's not hugely important. So for uh, to get 14,000 experience that way, you would need roughly 116 advanced tokens in that case. In order to get 116 advanced tokens in the VIP shop, it's going to cost you 250 uh, blue diamonds each. They're right here, 250 of them. 250 blue diamonds for each, so um, that is a way to get roughly a blue diamond equivalent of 29,000 blue diamonds. 
Now, again, be clear, like, blue diamonds are not going to get you that many um, experience tokens. Like, you're going to need to buy those very slowly. It's going to take you a lot longer than just doing this over seven days. Uh, and so it is important to kind of keep in mind that's not a very great comparison. But we can look at the 50 Black Diamond Dragon Awakening Pack that's available in the shop. Um, this one, you get 28 100 blue diamonds, 40 advanced tokens. Again, we're going to approximate there about 120 experience each. You get one epic token or one epic scroll, one blue scroll, one green scroll, and those are worth 500, 110. So that's a total of 5,410 experience, assuming that we're getting again 120 for each of those 40 advanced tokens. Uh, pretty clearly, this is a way, way worse deal than the purple experience scrolls would be just buying them straight here. Now there are a lot of reasons maybe you want to actually get the advanced tokens. Maybe there's some skill that you want um, to be able to get. So it's not again a direct conversion and keep in mind with anything that you're buying from the shop you can use coupons and other things to make it a better deal so just because the monthly pass one is better doesn't mean that you should only do that one. Now with that in mind I think that this experience one is a diamond in the rough. I think this is a surprisingly good purchase that might really be worth it to you. 14,000 experience is a lot. And if you need to increase the skills on your dragon quickly, I really think this is a good way to do it. And there's not a lot of other things available for purchase that can get you there that quickly. So I really think that this one is worth taking a look at. On the whole, that's kind of my main takeaway. The honor banner is the most worth it, but there are a lot of ways to get honor banners. You know, there are plenty of different events, plenty of different packs where you get them. Maybe you don't need honor banners in this moment, so maybe you don't prioritize that one as much, but definitely the most bang for your buck. Um, XP scroll is the one I think is probably the most worth it. In terms of just they're hard to come by, not necessarily easy to get except for with black diamonds or just grinding away over a long period of time. So for that perspective, I do see a lot of value in the XP scroll. That being said, some people may just not need it at all. If you have plenty of uh, experience scrolls or if you just don't need to increase your skills anymore on your dragon, totally understood, you may not need it. The Ancient Scripture is probably the one that I think most people will buy just because uh, Ancient Scriptures are so so in demand right now in that race, as I've said before, to get to Tier 5 troops. The one that I hope you all know not to get is this research one. Um, frankly, if you're a new account, if you really need research speedups, as you can see from up here, it is the best deal for purely getting research scrolls. But you shouldn't be doing that. There are just so many better things to spend your black diamonds on. If you're at that stage in the game, go for the honor banners, honestly. But I hope this was really helpful. I know there's a lot of information here. There's a lot of math. But I hope that you guys learned a thing or two. And until next time, my name is Tyrion Lannister. I'll see you then.